Now, folks, that's 300 miles from here. <laughs> okay, if they found pieces of it in Phoenix, Arizona, then why come they didn't find them in Las Vegas? We're only 30 miles from there. Did that make sense? Yeah. Come on, y'all. Did that make sense? Yep. Yeah. yeah, but you see what I'm saying now, right? About what they say. I always wonder about these scientists. I think, where the heck do they find this information? How, how do you do that? <laughs> you know? <laughs> oh, man. Now, the average home price here in Boulder City is $350,000. Average. That's for the poor section of town. <laughs> That's where we would live. Okay. <laughs> See what I'm saying? That's where we would live. They got some really uh, fancy houses out here. They got a lot of... Debbie Come on. Debbie Debbie Reynolds. Reynolds. All right. Look up on top of the mountain. You're going to see a brown house with some trees in front of it. Do you see that? Yeah. Or oh, the second name I said. Michael Jordan. All right. Look. Let me get a little closer here. Look dead smack in the center of all those houses. You're going to see a brown house with three little windows on top of it. Uh, right. You should be able to see it about now. Yep. Okay, well, the third name I said. Tom Selleck. All right. The reason why I did it that way is because a few years ago, we had one of our bus drivers come out here and told the people where the stars lived. You know the attorneys had fun with that because somebody went back to their house and got in their car and drove out to them people's house. Okay? So the attorneys had a great time with that. Don't tell the people where the stars live, blah, 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 blah. You know what I mean? So... There's more than one way to skin a cat. Guess what? I didn't tell you. You told me. This is where we do it. If you don't want to do it here, you can drive six hours to California and do it on the Pacific Ocean. <laughs> what do you think? Which one would you choose? Right? That's why you see all them boats in Boulder City, okay? That's the reason why you see all the boats in Boulder City. Can you imagine the lake when it was 125 foot high? Yeah. You can see where the white rim is. That's how it looked when I first came here. <laughs> when it was hot. Yeah. Really now, we're getting ready to pass the Hacienda Hotel and Casino. Uh -huh. At the Hacienda, there's a... Uh, Hacienda used That's to be called the Gold today. Strike yeah. at one time. A family used to own that place years ago. Yeah, right. yeah. Okay? But now it's called the Hacienda, with after the name of the hotel casino that was on the strip. Yeah, which now okay. has uh, Mandalay Bay there. Ah. Makes sense, don't it? I wonder how they got the name. I'm sure they was copyrighted. But well, now we're getting ready to head toward the Pat, um, Michael Callahan, Pat Tillman Bridge. Now I'm going to be honest with you. There's about 80 steps to go up, and it's kind of steep. So if you choose not to do it, that's just fine. Okay? I'm going to be honest with you. It's a pretty nice little climb. Okay? I stop at the IMAX, and we got to go to two different points. And I want you all to be able to see both points, all right? Because if it gets dark, you're not gonna see anything, right? And it gets dark early. So please be on time today we make our stops, okay? I wanna make sure that you're able to see what we come to see today. Make sense? Yeah. All right. Y'all work with me and I'll make sure you get a chance to see everything you need to see, okay? Really spectacular. Why did you see the bridge? Now we're getting ready to head toward the security checkpoint. Like I said, just stay in your seats. Don't worry about it. Okay, so I'm gonna okay, it's been here since moment, September yeah? 11, 2001. Oh After September 11, they put the uh, security checkpoint in. Yes, I am driving with one hand, and I'm talking on a microphone. And I'm going kind of slow today. I generally go a lot faster. <laughs> right, that makes you feel real good about right now, don't it? So you're driving and talking at the same time. It's like a roller coaster ride. Oh, why not? Everyone's going very fast. Boy, that quiet in here all of a sudden, isn't it? Boy, y'all don't want to talk now, do you? There's the security check. Okay. We'll take about 15, you know, about 15 minutes. You know, it really ain't. But you guys. Like I said, we're going to take about 15 minutes to get out of here so we can head on toward Kingman, okay? We got a long day ahead of us. All right? We have to come back here to get on that freeway so we can go over the bridge. And go pick up again. 
At least the buses have permission to go over the dam. Can you pull your bus on the side? We need to strip search. Uh, pull over your car, please. No, man. You're just driving without a license? Yeah. Have you got a license? Did you got a license? Did you got a license? Did you got a license? It's not a license, it's spelled Luxans. Did you got a license? <laughs> Come on stairs. Yeah. If you had to push the wheelchair with Shelly all the way up here, there'd be a lot of work. Ooh. A lot of uphill, you know. You do that every day, I get very fit, very fast. <laughs> Thank you. 
Katarina, yep. move for a second. Wow.